Greg Cosell here on the Rich Eisen Show. What do you think Belichick's going to do at his quarterback position? What do you think his plan is right now, Greg? Well, you're asking me to get into the head of Bill Belichick? Yes, I am. I mean, just wow. or at least, um, or just to, just to, just to, again, because the evaluation involves Jared Stidham. The evaluation involves maybe somebody in this draft, Jalen Hurts, somebody yeah. that might be available rounds two, three, four, that Belichick thinks I can grab this guy with Hoyer and Stidham and create myself a quarterback room that I can still win this division with this year and well, beyond. I think if you if you look at Belichick, I think for him, and, and these are, are cliched terms, but they're true, I think Belichick really loves decision-making and ball placement. Those are two of the traits, I think, that would be near the top of his list. Um, don't forget, at his core, he's a defensive coach. He does not want the ball turned over. And the NFL game, for a quarterback now, with so much quick game, is about ball placement. Because it's ball placement that creates run-after-catch for receivers more than the receiver himself. So if you look in later rounds, you know that's where it's hard to know. I mean, I, that's where talking to players comes into play. I mean, there's a quarterback from FIU. I don't know if he likes him at all, but James Morgan is a very interesting later round prospect. Uh, The wild card here is we don't know what he thinks of Stidham, just like we had no idea what he thought of Brady back uh, 20 years ago. No doubt. He may really like Jared Stidham and feel like, you know what, I can line up with this guy and he's going to be a good player. Well, where was he last year in your evaluation and where you think that that he might be a second year guy? Because again, you you know, we we only have that one one moment against the Jets where he threw a pick six, got benched, Cody Kessler gets signed, but he did just get released yesterday. I, I am wondering where, where you think Stidham could actually reside as a second-year quarterback. Yeah, I think Stidham, Stidham was a guy whose tape was very erratic coming out of Auburn, and a lot of people did not love their offense, You know, the offense he was asked to run, but that's that's all we could watch. Talented arm. Um so I think ultimately you look at a player that has talent and, and the issues can be worked on and cleaned up. And he threw the ball well and looked good in training camp last year and in preseason, whatever that means. Um, I made the point in my notes that he could develop into a quality starter, but there are many variables for him to reach that point. Now he's obviously with a great coach and a great program. Uh, so I think within the context of what they want the quarterback to do, and you can't just say, well, they had Tom Brady. They have a certain sense of what they want their quarterback to do. I think that Stidham could fill that role.